Hey what is up you guys my name is Sub-Zero Xtabyte and I am shooting right back at you today with another episode of Do Not Mess With Sub His Minecraft World. I know that I have never called it this before but since people do not seem to leave me alone in this world I will try to make it as clear as possible that people really need to stay out of here because I am getting sick and tired of this every day. So last week someone broke into my house again after I moved like a thousand blocks away from my old house. So you might be thinking like well sub what in the world are you doing right now i mean i am just throwing around with some blocks right well no you would be kind of wrong about that because what i am doing right now is nothing less than necessary when people think that they can just fool around with my house and destroy my property and belongings now having said that i am going to be dedicating this video today to make the most secure house possible in the world of minecraft even though this might sound a little bit over the top I think that it is my right to secure myself and my house to the fullest range of my capabilities and I am willing to pay a lot of robux for these security measurements that I am going to be taking today. Because like I previously said, and before that and before that, I am sick and tired of the fact that people seem to not care about any of my personal belongings in here. I mean I have said this a thousand times already and I am going to be saying this again. I only join into this Minecraft world whenever I need some peace and some rest and just some space in general. I mean I got dumped by this beautiful lady this week and I am just tired of people stealing my stuff and all of that. So right now I am going to be protecting my house, and I am going to make sure that anyone who dares to still cross me with all of this. Well I am going to make sure that ends will meet with them because I am not backing down from a fight and I am not going to be putting down these arrows because I am Sub-Zero Extabyte and I am going to become a force to be reckoned with. Now with that said I will still have to do a lot of things to do. Alright so guys. Guys please forgive me right now for what I am doing with this thing here because I literally have no idea what I am doing right now. This is just some on the fly thinking right here because I literally have no idea how to use all of this. So if you have any sort of tips and tricks for me well it will always be welcome of course. But right now I do not really have enough time to go look for some tutorials because I will really need to make sure that no one finds me in this hole. I mean no one will find me right. I told that him to just go away a couple of minutes ago so I hope that he respects that instead of following me or coming back with like a group of guys or something because I usually get intimidated pretty quick and I am like a turtle. I will need a shell so that I can hide in there. And right now I do not have a shell so this is basically my shell right now. I will have to make sure that I can get through this otherwise I will not have my shell for whenever more people show up. And then well that means that it is time to panic for me. It was like when you make a move in chess and just as you take your finger off the piece, you see the mistake you've made. And there's this panic because you don't know yet the scale of disaster you've left yourself open to. This literally describes what I am doing right now. That was a quote by the way from an author called Kazuo Ishiguro. I probably butchered the pronunciation on that name but that does not matter right now. What matters is that this is a chess game and I am running out of plays to make. And I really do not want this one to end in a loss or a stalemate because I will not be able to handle any one of those. I will be needing a decisive victory right here so that I can finally get some rest. Because well you might have noticed because of the way that I am acting right now but I have not slept since the day that my house got blown up. I mean the time that Harambran was sleeping in my bed, well that does not make it any easier to close your eyes. And I mean I still shut my eyes but all I can see is what my house used to be before it got blown up by that guy. But that is in the past. Now maybe to you this is not a lot of fun. But to me it is or at least it was. But like I said I wanted something new. I wanted something different. I wanted something that I could be doing for the rest of my life. So when building came around I was really excited and this lava thing is making it even better. Because it was the one thing that I enjoyed the most. Now why it already was a pretty active person when I was younger. But this much has doubled my enthusiasm for activity. So don't get me wrong I am not saying that building is for everyone. But I am saying that if you have not tried it yet then maybe you should. Because it really is a lot of fun. It takes a lot of practice. But I've already talked about this once in a video. Something that takes a lot of practice is usually worth doing. Because you might become a pro at it. Now they always told me that in order for you to become a pro at something. You will have to spend at least 
10,000 hours into that thing. Now we have something to actually get done with my security installations but you know that will come with time and I hope that the people who still think that they can just try and mess with me are able to see then that I am not someone that they can fool around with. Because like I said previously in this video and as I have said in many other of these Minecraft videos, I only come here when I need some rest and relaxation and some peace of mind. So whenever I come around this place for any of those three things and I come up to my house and I see that it is gone because some Harambran guy decided that it was worth it to destroy my house or for some random noobs to come crash into my world through some random portal that I have never seen before. Well that is just the time that I am going to be defending myself against these people to make sure that I can just use this beautiful world that we call Minecraft for my relaxation and some spa kind of like activities. Now that may sound weird but you know a man has got to do what a man has got to do to get some relaxing around here for himself right. Now let's do this. Now it may not look like something with high tech security right now but once I am done with all of the building and construction then you will be able to see that no one thief will be able to storm into my house and steal stuff. That is just how good I am at this and that is just something that I like to do. I like to prove people wrong and that is just the thing that I am going to be doing around here. Now let me quote you this from a book called Walden written by Henry David Thoreau and he says, and I quote, If you have built castles in the air, your work need not be lost. That is where they should be. Now put the foundations under them. So I feel like I have always been the one that was building castles in the air. Now need it be that I did that around here in Minecraft or Roblox or just in my head that does not really matter. The essence of this quote is the fact that he says that you need to put the foundations underneath those air castles and that will make sure that they become a reality. So the foundations are the hard work that one were to put in when doing something like that. Now I will be the one who is going to put the foundations underneath of my castles in the air. I am going to make sure that no one can mess around with the Sub-Zero X to bite the Great anymore and they will all regret regret every crossing me. Now let's close this up with this fine lava right here and choose ourselves a little nice color for the home because I want something that matches the red of the lava which will be looking toads amazing when we are done and you will not get enough of it. And would you look at that we did it boys, this is stage 1 of my super awesome security project that is like going to be super awesome. I mean I would not think that it would be anything less than awesome just because you know, I mean come on people take a look at me and you would see that I I am just here to rule the world. I mean I am not here to rule the world just ignore the fact that I even said that but I am here to rule over anyone who is trying to break the rules. I am a rule enforcer as you would say. Or you know I could be more like a law enforcer. Oh my god you guys I am basically a police officer right now. That is amazing. I love and support the blue line. So shout out to any of the cops out there and say safe. Now of course none of this would be able if I was not that much of a mastermind and I am going to do everything that I can to be able to get this done and to make sure that no one will be able to ever mess with me again. Because that is how I roll. I command and I conquer you could see me like the new Donald J Trump but then less old than he is. Only I am not building a wall, because my wall is the water basically. Alright so guys please forgive me right now for what I am doing with this thing here because I literally have no idea what I am doing right now. This is just some on the fly thinking right here because I literally have no idea how to use all of this. So if you have any sort of tips and tricks for me well it will always be welcome of course. But right now I do not really have enough time to go look for some tutorials because I will really need to make sure that no one finds me in the middle of this lava lake. So I am just going to be hoping that this lava approach to my house actually works otherwise, like I just said. I am going to be real hot man. Okay maybe not a hot man because it is not like the houses are that cool. But I am just going to be making sure that once I get this done that I am going to go right back to bed for like a week. Because right now I actually am kind of a dead man when it comes to this. I mean there is no such thing as getting too much sleep for me right now. Because right now it just feels like I am not even doing anything anymore. All day long I am just roaming around my house and stuff without a thought and I am just so tired that I have got no idea what to go do but then when I think that I might be able to go to bed and the second that my head hits my pillowcase there is another person at my door and I have got to get up again to be able to defend the fort I mean there is not worse feeling than this but all of that will soon come to an end because I actually feel confident about this right now I mean no one will find me right 
I told that him to just go away a couple of minutes ago so I hope that he respects that instead of following me or coming back with like a group of guys or something because I usually get intimidated pretty quick and I am like a turtle. I will need a shell so that I can hide in there and right now I do not have a shell so this is basically my shell right now. I will have to make sure that I can get through this otherwise I will not have my shell for whenever more people show up and then well that means that it is time to panic for me. It was like when you make a move in chess and just as you take your finger off the piece, you see the mistake you've made, and there's this panic because you don't know yet the scale of disaster you've left yourself open to. This literally describes what I am doing right now. That was a quote by the way from an author called Kazuo Ishiguro. I probably butchered the pronunciation on that name but that does not matter right now. What matters is that this is a chess game and I am running out of plays to make. And I really do not want this one to end in a loss or a stalemate because I will not be able to handle any one of those. I will be needing a decisive victory right here so that I can finally get some rest. Because well you might have noticed because of the way that I am acting right now but I have not slept since the day that my house got blown up. I mean the time that Harambran was sleeping in my bed, well that does not make it any easier to close your eyes. And I mean I still shut my eyes but all I can see is what my house used to be before it got blown up by that guy. But that is in the past. Now of course I have got a whole assorted thing about all the times that I encountered something that wanted to kill me really bad so that is not my main concern here right now. I just want to focus on what is to come and usually that has a lot to do with other people. I mean I can get blown up by stuff but it usually is not totally my fault. No the totally in that sentence, because sometimes it actually is and I am just being stupid. But with all of that aside, I think that it might actually be time to start actually doing something more than decorating this place. Are you all with me on this one? Now I really do not like to think about that. I mean I could go on dwelling about whatever has happened but I would rather focus on what is coming up. So basically what is coming up right now for me, well that is this guy that just jumped into his new home a couple of minutes ago. Or actually not a couple of minutes ago but rather in the future. I really should not be telling you all this much about this project but that is okay. I mean I cannot just go ahead and treat all of this like I know what I am doing because I really do not know what I am doing at all. I mean I am just winging all of this right now because I feel like I otherwise regress and that is not something that I want to do. I really want to put in the ever forward mindset because I feel like moving forward and progressing is the best thing that you can do whenever you feel like you are stagnating and feeling complacent. So I really just want to move on right here and get moving so that I can actually finish this and not end up being a complete disappointment right now right here. So let's just hope for the best now. Without anyone near that would be able to see me or anything because this is pretty much one of my weakest moments. And I would rather not have it that anyone would be able to see that. Because I feel like I am not some weak dude hanging out in Minecraft. But of course right now you guys will know that I actually am. Which feels pretty bad. But like I said, or as I will say now, I do not have any secrets for you guys. So I think that this thing will pretty much protect me from anyone who is in here. Because come on if I can make this underground bunker with a mechanical entrance, well come on people who will be able to find that. There is just no way that anyone will find out that I am here. And otherwise, well I actually have no idea what I will do then because this is basically my last resort right now. I am literally on my last straw since I was looking like a fool trying to do all of this stuff with redstone because well I am basically a gigantic redstone noob and redstone does not work well with lava okay well of course I will have to get out of this right so you know this thing will not work because I cannot just leave my house unlocked like that otherwise those darn strangers will definitely be showing up again. So I will need to find something new that will work instead of this. So I guess that this will work right. I mean there is no way that anyone would be suspicious of just some lava around this place. I mean it might look like a dump but that is the point right. Who would go looking for me at a dump? So I guess that will work out. Wait what in the world is that? Is that a freaking camera? What is that guy doing? Oh my god alright. I have already been spotted while my house is not even finished yet. Well I guess it is time to move again. So shall we just move on then? So as you can see the night is already falling and we are nowhere near close right now. I 
mean this is just not something that I do on a day to day basis so I might be a little bit slow right now. So just forgive me for that please and stick with me until the bitter end please you guys. But let's just hope that the lava thing that I just built is actually going to be a success because otherwise I will actually have to turn to my last resort which would be the underwater base. And I really do not want to turn to my last resort so quickly because I just feel like there is too much counting on that. So let me just get everything straight right here type lava and the other way around but i will see you guys in the next video see you later you guys